Hey guys, so we are on, I don't know what uh, edition this is, but I'll definitely put it in this video, but we are organizing and decluttering my everyday makeup drawer. This is where I switched out things. If I do not like it, this is where I'm going to declutter. I know I'm going to still have large like declutters, but I feel like to maintain on a monthly basis just to get rid of things that I'm not liking this is the immediate way that I feel like I'm going to do that so let's just hop right in so pretty much I'm getting through this I'm almost done I'm like up to here where that line is so I'm really good with like getting through skincare especially going through it every day my hangover rx I'm almost done with this I'm so happy with the progress that I've made on this so you'll see an update so my project pan products will probably be in here next what I'm going to put in here over to the side actually is the bronzer that I've been using in my Ofra palette a lot more progress on this one and I'm really excited about this I am going to bring a different powder I'm gonna put this over here actually let me take these out put this right here progress on that I am actually done you'll see this in a update video but I'm actually done with this because y'all this powder is everywhere I try to like I don't know I maybe I need to look at a repressed video but the particles are getting on me and it's a bit messy so I'm gonna call it quits on this I got some use out of this so I'm going to be replacing this with another powder and that is the Sasha and I've already hit pan on this but I just want to make some more progress on this and this is the Sa Sasha pressed powder uh, as you can say see I made a little dent in there and I really do enjoy this uh, formula so I'm gonna actually put this one in here I've made more progress on this blush by Mac and pink swoon so that's going in there I still have to hit pan on this beige shade right here but I've made more progress with that beige shade but I need to keep this in here so I can make progress when out of sight out of mind that's what I love about uh, my project pans and I'm looking for my primer I'm actually gonna put something else in a project pan in the project pan as well I need to get uh, done with these so whether it's setting my brow uh, cleaning up my brows or doing my using these as a, my under eye I'm going to be using this this is the NC 42 and NC 35 in the Mac studio these are the studio finish concealers so I am going to actually put this in the project pan. I know that I have hit my goal with um, the powder, the setting powder. So I am, I put another setting powder in here and I'm going to actually put these, uh, I'm not gonna put these in the project pan because it's seven, finished seven by fall. So I'm still gonna be using those though. I'm gonna put these in here to use. So I'll put these over there. I do have my NARS Weightless Luminous right here that's in the project pan. I've only made a little bit of progress on this. So it was here and now it's like down here. You see where that line is? That's where it kind of like settles. So I'm gonna put this in here. And I can't find my primer, but I definitely will put that in there. So. Not to worry, it will be in there soon. Okay, so moving on, we have a foundation. We have a, okay. We have a foundation, we have a primer. We have, now that one's a water-based primer. This is like a silicone-based primer, although it's moisture blur. It does have contain silicone, so we're gonna put this in here. And I'm actually gonna take this one out. I feel like I'm able to use things when I don't have too many things in here. Uh, Y'all see how many headbands? I mean, <laughs> I've been like organizing stuff. Um, this, I actually, the setting powder, I actually want to finish up. 
So we're gonna do that. I'm just uh, setting the lighting, you guys. But uh, yeah, so we're gonna keep this in here. This is a setting, like a face finishing powder by MAC. Um, I'm going to use this and if I don't use, if I don't actually grab for this, this month, then I'm going to pass it on. The Laneige, this is a quick fix for me. That's great for every day. We, we'll keep it right there. Now, this Lumin uh, No Soap Blush, I think I'm going to, this is going to be in my next, I like keeping this in because it's a peach, but this is probably going to be my next blush that I work on. It's actually flat. It usually comes dome and I've had this forever. So I definitely, I love that blush, but it's getting old. I'm going to keep my Marc Jacobs in here. Although I have the other one, I have been really loving this one and it looks like I have not put a dent, but I promise you I've been using that. That was in a favorites video last month. This contour highlight palette, I am going to I'm going to keep this in just because it has the contour in it. I have not used this blush palette. I'm going to take that out. Keep this in. Sweet Peach palette is staying in. I am going to, I'm going to leave these ColourPop in here, although I'm not using them just yet. Um, just because I don't have anywhere for, to put them right now. So I did take out the Mariah Carey. I'm going to use this during the holiday. So yeah. Now let's talk about what we're going to put in. Okay, so we are testing some things for our BoxyCharm. I want to try this Rainforest of the Sea. This one has some basic colors. I am project panning the other one, but you know, I want to put this in so I don't get bored with the other one. I might not reach for this, but it's okay. I feel like when I have options, I, I will tend to use this rather than getting bored and not using it at all. So we're going to put that in there. These uh, brushes, I'm going to actually, I'm going to put them in here just so y'all can see them. This is like a face and cheek. I'm going to try this for my cheek and see how I like it. It's for my, um, because I didn't like it for my lips, but I might like it for my cheeks. I might use that today, speaking of that, because I don't have on any makeup right now. And this right here. So that's for my BoxyCharm. The other items are some lashes. I'm not going to use those right now. Do I have any upcoming events? If I do, I'll wear the lashes. As a matter of fact, I do. Do I want to wear these? These are like luxe free, but cruelty free, but you can use these like 30 times. Maybe I'll, I'll pop them in here. That way I'll just have something. Okay, so that's from BoxyCharm. The Hourglass Vanish Stick Foundation. This is in beige. This is gonna, <laughs> this is gonna be great for me as a concealer. I am gonna put that in there. I'm gonna put the, what is that? Beauty Blender, the mini. I'm going, I'm going to put this mascara and primer in here. And I'm going to use this Lancer scrub. So I'm going to put that in there from... I can't use the dry shampoo right now because my hair is curly. But I am going to put this Dolce Gabbana. This is great to throw in. I'm actually going to put it up here in my drawer because I always go for perfumes when I'm on the go. Ipsy, I'm going to put this brush in here for my unboxing. That one's going to be great for like contour and buffing. Um, I already have a mascara in here. I love this excessive lash. I'm not going to open it. I've uh, talked about this before in a favorites, so I'm not going to open that. I don't need it right now. The balm, this eyeshadow, I'm, I am going to put in here. I'm going to tell them that I don't want any more eyeshadows because I really don't yeah. need it. As a matter of fact, you know what? I'm going to give this to, I'm going to add this to the next one because I really don't need eyeshadows and somebody else might. So I'm, I'm going to take that one out and I'm going to leave that. I'm going to leave that one. This is a facial scrub from Honey. I want to try that. So I'm going to put that in there. Uh, this is a liquid coal. Ooh, I want to try this. 
This is from the brand Seraphim or something. I'm gonna put that in there. I'm gonna be trying the Dose of Colors palettes are going in here. This is the, the girls palette. And which I've swatched, but I haven't put on my eyes and me that may. That's why I did not want that gold palette in here. So I really want to try these. So I'm actually going to put them over here. So I tend to reach for them. Totally forgot. I have the palettes, but the lip, I have no shade, more, no, more creamer, please. And over the top, I am going to put these over here with the lippies. I'm really excited about using those. And yeah. I heard that they're supposed to be having a restock soon. So yeah, there you go. So that is it. This is my makeup drawer and organization and declutter for September. This is the stuff I'm going to be using. I'm really excited because I feel like having one of like everything is the way to go. I have something for every day. I have like, this is like a foundation that I could wear when I want to get fancy or to church. I have something, you know, this I can use for every day or my Laneige. I just, I'm really happy with what I have right here. So thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Okay.